A Low Country nonprofit organization is aiming to prevent and treat the invisible wounds that affect members of our armed forces. It's all through a sailing program called Veterans on Deck. And here to tell us all about Veterans on Deck is Paul Jock, the president and CEO of the organization. Thanks for being here with us. Oh, it's my pleasure, Raphael. Thanks for inviting me. It sounds like a very interesting program that uh, benefits our former service members. How exactly does it work? Well, we invite veterans uh, to come out sailing with us. We, we reach out to the uh, veterans with PTSD especially. Um, we're a, a community collaborator with the VA Medical Center, and the mental health workers over there know about our program because we've been around for 13 years. And so they refer the veterans over to us. They show up when we go on, uh, on the male veterans can come on Tuesdays and Fridays. And so they just show up at the dock at one o'clock. We go out for a two hour cruise and uh, if they enjoy it, they come back and it, the camaraderie really brings them back. So what is the magic in this program? We talked about uh, people benefiting uh, from mental health and PTSD. What is it about being on the water that offers some relief? I think part of it is the collaboration and, and working with um, fellow military people. You know, there's a, our brothers in arms, so we know what they've been through. We've experienced some of the same things that, that are impacting them. And so the collaboration on getting the boat moving in the right direction against the current, with the wind, and, and it's a new experience. And you know, the, it's very calming because we don't have, we shut off the engine as soon as we can, get the sail set, and so you hear the, the wind rustling through the sails and the waves lapping against the hull. And it's, and it's reassuring and calming. And the, the patients or the clients that have PTSD, they want to you know, isolate themselves and they suffer from depression and anxiety. And this gets them out of that isolation. Um, Ron Cerno, who established this program 13 years ago, he, he was a psychologist and a researcher at MUSC. And he established this and he studied the outcomes. And, the veterans that have PTSD, it decreased their depression, it decreased their anxiety, and the little bit of stress that they have when they go out sailing was beneficial for them. That is interesting. So the members of the military, what do you have more of? Do you have more members of the Navy and the Coast Guard who are used to this sort of thing or members from other branches? All branches, um, except the... Uh, um, Star Wars, <laughs> Star Force. No Star Force members <laughs> right, yet, right. but it's open to but, them, right? It is. It all is. right. But uh, yeah, it's, it's all branches and uh, it's really exciting and they seem to enjoy it a lot. Um, all right, very good. And again, specifically, you chose veterans. Uh, why veterans specifically? Why veterans? Well, Ron Cerno established it with the VA Medical Center and so he was working with the veterans and so it was easier to, to uh, establish and get the veterans to come on board the boat. And um, all our captains and, and first mates are uh, veterans as well. So it's really a, a veteran volunteer run organization. Very good. And if you're interested in taking part, you can do so. Uh, Paul, thank you very much for being here with us and sharing this information. Veterans on Deck sells three times a week, as you mentioned, and the schedule is posted on our website. They sell from 1 till 3 every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday, and selling to the scenic Charleston Harbor. You'll find more information on the website, which is linked under the big red box. Hope you see you there.